Hello viewers, we have a very beautiful sort um, to simplify. Square root of 7 plus 4 root 3. Now let's see, there's something I would love to do here. Let's see square root of um, 7 plus 4 root 3 to be equal to sum square root of A plus square root of B. Just an assumption, right? Let this to be that. So let's do something here. For the whole of this, I can have it, if I square both sides, I'll have square root of 7 plus 4 root 3 all squared to be square root of a plus square root of b all squared so that this can cancel out and i'll have 7 plus 4 root 3 to be equal to let's expand this down if you do it nicely let me just give a hint then drop the answer excuse me it's going to be something like square root of a plus square root of b square root of a plus square root of b if you simplify this down you're going to have your answer to be a plus b plus 2 root a b if you expand it nicely right now for this we are having um let's do something here we'll compare the two terms i want to give this that does not have a square root i'll compare with this and this that has a square root i'll compare with this right so let's do something here that means we'll have a plus b to be 7 because we don't have a square root sign right at the same time um, 2 root a b for this part will be 4 root 3 so let's reduce it down this is very important let's keep it let me just call it like my first equation i'll just keep it this way now for this i want to make a b subject of the formula so i can call it my second equation right now for this i can divide both sides by 2 by so doing i will have square root of a b to be equals to um, 2 root 3, right? Because 2 will go into this, we have this. I take the square on both sides, I will have it that AB is equals to 4 times 3 is 12. Let me just give a recap of what I did, because I know a lot of people will be confused about it. For this, if you square both sides, you will have AB, to because if you square this, you will have 4 times, if you square this, you have 3 which means a b is equals to 12 that's what i did here right and i can just call it my second equation right now let's combine the equation the first equation and the second let me write a plus b equals to 7 and a b equals to 12. now from equation 1 we can see clearly that a is equals to 7 minus b right a is equals to 7 minus b I want to um i'm working on this here so that if a is equal to this i want to substitute it here and see what i can have i will have 7 minus b times b is equal to 12 so that i can expand i will have 7 b minus b squared is equal to 12 so that i can rearrange to be minus b squared plus 7 b minus 12 is equal to zero i don't want the zero here so let me do something i'll multiply through by minus so i'll have b squared minus 7b plus 12 to be equal to zero now let's factorize this out so we'll have um two numbers that will satisfy this so i will do it to be b squared i need two numbers such that if i add up i have minus seven if i multiply i have positive 12 that's minus 3b minus 4b plus 12 to be zero so that from here i can group it into two and if you factorize nicely you are going to have b minus three and b minus four yes b minus three b minus four to be zero and if you solve this you are going to have b to be positive three and b to be positive four now since i've um, i've gotten the value of a and b i can substitute this in any of this equation i mean this particular equation to get oh let's put it here a since b is 3 and 4 i can substitute here so excuse me let me just let me continue beside here excuse me so this is going to be a is equals to 7 minus what is b b is 3 if b is 3 let me see if b equals to 3 i will have a to be 4 and if b is equals to 4 i will have a to be three so it can be anything right now since i know of that i will just do something here i will say um recall we mentioned something earlier that square root of seven plus um four root three to be square root of a 
plus square root of b right so let's substitute any of the values and see what we are going to have this means square root of sorry square root of 7 plus 4 root 3 is equals to square root of a let's pick a to be 4 so square root of 4 plus square root of b to be 3 still works right so that this is equals to 2 plus square root of 3 and this is our result thanks for watching and see you in the next episode